Hello, thank you for joining us. This is the Transfer Hub, and today is an exclusive day, so it is nice you've joined us, and thank you very much. And uh, gradually, we are putting up this video in a good shape so that at least you would make here your home, your 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 TV on YouTube. You will come here all the time, enjoy the content here. Recommend for people that this is the only platform. We get to talk about Ghana football, the platform where we narrate stories of our league. So thank you for sticking with us. And my name is Shaban Mohammed once again. This is Mo TV. You can follow me on Facebook. It's Shaban Mohammed on Facebook again. It is Mo TV. And then um on YouTube, Mo TV, of course, you are following us. And I know you are recommending for people on Twitter it is at Shaban Mo9. And also on Instagram, I am authentic Mo Shaban and TikTok is. Shaban Mohammed. Let's follow all the updates and then take note of everything. I have always told you this is the platform where we bring you authentic stories. Here, we don't mix up the story, we don't mix anything with the story. We go straight to the point and tell you what you need to know. Thank you. So, let's start with the transfer update. Now, let me start with Hussein Mohammed. Hussein Mohammed. Now, Hussein Mohammed is, uh, is an attacking midfielder from DBB United who had a trial with heart to foot. Now, um, today, he, ha he has undergone medical. He has undergone medical today. And everything is set. Um, one, heart to foot have agreed a deal with his club, DBB United. And so the agreement is done on Hussein Mohammed. agreement is done club to club. And then I informed you that player to player agreement is almost done. He has undergone medical today and he's expected to sign a contract tomorrow is Sunday. And so Monday, Hussein Mohammed will sign a three years contract with Heart of Folk plus one. Three years contract with Heart of Folk plus one. It means that um, after signing for three years, there's a clause that says that he has to activate another one year for the club. That is this one is done maybe if the player has a deal and he wants to leave and all that the club can activate that clause and then get something out of the deal so hussein mohammed an attacking midfielder from dbb is almost a harsh player he's almost a harsh player now let's move on to one aspect the fans have been asking that is the left back position and at that position it has always been Dennis Korsaba. Corsa has not been part of the team, though uh, they've been news circulating that he won't be part of the coach's project and all that. Now, one player who participated in the Omaha Charity Cup uh, last weekend uh, was um, Ransford Mensa, and he is a player from Dambut FC. And Dambut are Division 2. Then he joined Mediama FC. He was coming from Dambut, okay? So when he was coming from uh, Media uh, was coming from Dambut straight to Media My SN was successful. So from Dambut straight to Media Mine he was successful. That is Jonathan Sua. That is where Jonathan Sua plays his football. Now, interestingly, um, they have also agreed a deal with Hatofuk. They have agreed a deal with Hatofuk. Dambut FC have agreed a deal with Hatofuk. And Ransford Mensa and the led back. Is going to sign for Heart of Folk. Now, after the game, Heart of Folk went ahead to communicate with Dambu FC about the move, about how they feel about the player and all that, and the project that you'll be part of. Now, um, what is happening is that so about the project that uh, is going to happen, and Coach Abu Bakar Watara feels that the player will be important for the project. The player will be important for the project, and so they will need him for the coming season. Now, this is what is going to happen. Um, currently, he's undergoing medical. That is Ransford Mensa. So if you're watching us exclusively, Ransford Mensa is undergoing medical as Heart of Folk player from Dambut FC. Heart of Folk player from Dambut FC. He's undergoing medical. Yes. She, she, she. <laughs> yeah, so the left back is undergoing medical. He won't be the only left back Heart of Folk will sign. They are looking at other options. Uh, another left back is expected to join. I'll be giving him the exclusive. So, um, Ransford Mensa is undergoing medical today. The agreement between Hearts and the player will be done today. Will be done today. 
you know, personal terms is ongoing. It is not finally done. But Hearts have agreed a deal with that boat. And the player has also agreed to sign a three-year contract. He has agreed to sign a three-year contract with Hearts of Oak. So that is uh, Ransford Mensa, Ransford Mensa, Ransford Mensa. That is something around him. These are the two players I'm reporting on. Let's move on to Edubiase. Let's go to Edubiase. Let's go to Edubias and talk about uh, Ahmed Ramsey. Let's talk about Ahmed Ramsey. Ahmed Ramsey. Now, um, Hart and Edubias are done with conversation. Hart and Edubias are done with conversation. On the attacking midfielder, Ahmed Ramsey. Yes, Ahmed Ramsey. And I think the full name is Ahmed Ramsey Yusuf, but let's use the Ahmed Ramsey. And Edubias and Hart of Oak have had a conversation. Everything is done. Between Haas and Edubiase, Haas and New Edubiase United. So Ramsey is always as a he plays as a winger and attacking midfielder. And so negotiations are done between Edubiase and Hart of Oak. Now, what is happening is that the player, the player will sign a contract for Hart of Oak on Monday. Will sign a contract for Hart of Oak on Monday. Medical is being done today. Medica has been done today. So I'm giving you all the exclusive around how to full camp. All the exclusive around how to camp. So Ahmed Ramsey is an Aguin Medica as a how to full player. You will sign on Monday. The personal terms is not a problem. The personal terms is not a problem. So how to full camp being sharp on their signings now. So Ahmed Ramsey is an attacking midfielder um, for New York BRC United. He has done with Medica. He's undergoing Medica now and would sign a three years contract with um his new team Heart of Folk. So that is something around him. Something around him, uh, Ahmed Ramsey. So take note of this information. Now let's talk about Chadrak Bello Bingi. Chadrak Bello Bingi. He arrived on Tuesday. He trained with the team on Wednesday, Thursday. Yesterday is Friday. Uh, yesterday was Friday, he trained with the team. So he trained Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. So bingy, bingy. He came on trial. By next week, Tuesday, the team will finalize on this agreement. Either he's staying or going. But then for now, for the training they've had, the coach is happy with him. Having scored 15 goals last year for his team in Congo. Yeah, so the team... Um, how to folk technical team are really impressed with the bingy. <laughs> they are really impressed with bingy. Bello bingy. Bello bingy. Bello Chadrak Bello bingy. Chadrak Bello bingy. How to folk are really impressed with the performance of the player and are going to offer him a contract. And that is expected to be done next week. We have eight days to go on the transfer deadline. And the deadline is next week, Sunday, 11.59. Next week, Sunday, 11.59, we'll be going live here. Uh, we'll be doing it together. We'll be sharing information together. We'll be talking together. We'll be doing everything together. You get it. So, we'll be doing it. so next week, we'll be live. So you have to join and enjoy some of the transfer deadline updates. You won't sleep next week. I also not sleep. <laughs> you won't sleep next week and I also not sleep. We won't all sleep. We all no go sleep next week. Yes. We all no go sleep. So that is something. You need to take note on. And so Chadrak Bello Bingi, Congolese striker, is showing glimpses of quality and the technical team are really happy with him. So we'll bring you the up to speed update around him. Mauli Wayo is undergoing medical, but the negotiation is not done. Yes. He's a free player, but uh, Mato Fuka is still talking to his manager, Elo. They are expected to complete everything by the close of Monday. So he's also undergoing medical, but the deal is not done on Mauli Wayo. That is an update around him. But whenever there is a deal completed, I'll bring you a breaking news, deal completed, breaking news, deal completed, breaking news, so that you take note of it. Kotoko, um, we'll go to Kotoko camp. Don't worry, we'll go to Kotoko. Let's talk about Steven Api Asari. Api Asari is a winger from Legon City's former Tema Youth winger. He's also expected to sign a contract for Art of Oak. He's also going to uh, undergo medical then sign an official contract with the team. So let's take note of the 
information above and then uh, jot down whatever I have said is going to uh, happen in the transfer market. My name is Shaban Mohamed. Yesterday, protocol lost 2 1 to Medium and Sporting Club at the new TNA Stadium. I'm sure you enjoy the game. What is your thought around the game? Who was your best player? Let me know. Who is your best player um, in, the, in the game between Kotoko and Mediama? Who was the best? Who was the best? Let me know so that we can also share our thoughts on this platform. Leave your thoughts here so that I'll read and then bring you a video around those comments. My name is Shaba Mohamed. See you again with breaking news. Bye-bye.